These Nigerian pilots have been trained by their Pakistan counterparts on how to operate these aircraft as well as its maintenance. The graduation ceremony marks the final takeover of the aircraft as Nigerian pilots can now fly and train other student pilots. The Air Officer Commanding of the Training Command, Air Vice Marshal Christopher Okoye, believes that the successful conversion of these pilots will enhance pilot training, which will in turn impact positively on operational effectiveness of the Nigerian Air Force, especially in its fight against insurgency and other criminality within the country. The Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar, who presented certificates to the graduating instructor pilots, says that training has remained a major means of transforming and repositioning the service over the years. Training is very important in deployment of air power. You have to have the right skills, you have to write, uh, have the right training if you are to be effective. So it is very, very important. It has a way of impacting and it's even more important now because we are reactivating airplanes with the support of the federal government. We are also inducting new airplanes with the support of the federal government. And who are those that are going to fly those airplanes? You have to train pilots. And that is why it's very significant to what we are doing, not only in the Northeast, but everywhere in the country. The Nigerian Air Force inducted the Super Mushak aircraft into its inventory in December 2016 to address the challenge of training pilots.